Holy, that's the wrong way of saying hello. I'm George X. Welcome to my seven questions of the day. If you're not a fan of me or you're just tuning in and you didn't catch my vlog yesterday, the seven questions of the day, I ask you seven questions and you give your opinion on it and I review what your, quite, like your answers are and we go on to the next seven questions of the day. This will be every day from now on. Okay, let's get started. Ready? Okay, this is for my gamers out there. If you guys are a fan of uh, Battlefield 3 on any like any like PC or Xbox 360 or PlayStation 3, they're having something called a rent a server. The server. This is what I looked up on Xbox uh, on the internet for Xbox because I'm a big Xbox fan and uh, most of my friends have Battlefield 3 for Xbox. Anyways, uh, you can rent a you can rent a server for up to one to ninety days, and the uh, one uh, one day cost uh, two dollars and forty five cents, and uh, for like. Like for another day, it's four dollars and ninety cents, and it goes up higher and stuff like that. So, gamers, what do you think? Do you think it's just a ripoff to rent a server, or you can, you know, it should be free, or do you think it's a good idea and I'd pay money for it? Comment or tweet me. Oh yeah, if y'all didn't catch me, I have a Twitter account. I'll put it in the description below. Tweet me, okay? Going, moving on to the second question of the day. Uh, there was a suicide attack in Afghanistan. Taliban are claiming it for responsibility for it. Nine people are dead now, and I do think that they should be stopped and stuff like that. Do you think? Okay, here's your question. Uh, do you think the American forces should focus? You know, send more people out there to patrol city, like to patrol streets, patrol back alleys, and stuff like that, to focus on not that many people getting hurt over there, or do you think they should send troops uh, somewhere else to help? You know. Not focus mostly on that because it's like most of the U.S. forces aren't getting hurt, but it's mostly NATO and stuff like that. I personally think they should stop that stuff. Moving on to question number three, the movie Bully. The movie Bully is a great, you know, film for kids. You know, not to bully. It's about a documentary about kids being bullied, and uh, like the, the name speaks for itself. Um, but other than that, um, most movie theaters aren't allowing it because it has like kids actually bullying other kids and I think it's kind of like bull crap. But anyways, I was bullied in school and that's not a very good feeling if you're a kid being bullied. You know, stop bullying. But uh, your question is, uh, do you think that school, pro school should have more programs about bullying like after school, clubs, you know, stop bullying like walks and runs and stuff like that? Or do you think they should just, you know, not care? But leave your comment and tweet me. Moving on to the next one, to uh, number four, there was, oh yeah, uh, preschoolers uh, to three to five years old that are being either daycared or uh, per, like being taken there by their parents or grandparents, stuff like that. Most of those kids aren't getting enough playtime outside, and I'm saying this is because this is our youth of America and, and probably the entire world. Uh, do you want your children being overweight and probably have like diabetes and stuff like that? Sorry if your family members have diabetes and stuff. But I don't want that if that was my kid. So do you think, your question is, do you think that uh, kids should have an hour a day considering to preschool and stuff like that? You know, whatever it is, they should have an hour a day. Or do you think they should focus more on school so they can get smarter? Comment and tweet me. Moving on to the next one. Number five. Are you a troll? This is another bullying type thing. But you, in Arizona, they're trying to pass a bill. Where if you start trolling or cyberbullying, you'll get thrown in jail for 25 years. I think it's kind of extreme for 25 years. I think they should just like, you know, ban you from the internet. And you gotta like go through this whole processing of paying stuff to get back on the internet. Or you can just move out of Arizona. Your question is, do you think cyberbullying or trolling in Arizona, do you think that people should get thrown in there for 25 years? Or do you think that cyberbullying is, like 25 years is a little extreme and you go with my idea? Tweet me or comment. Moving on to question number six. Do you like the Hunger Games? The Hunger Games uh, has a soundtrack out now. And it sold over, uh, I have it written down, uh, 1,075 million, like it's, a, like Google it. And uh, the, the soundtrack has no relation to uh, the sounds and um, the, the, the musics uh, in uh, the Hunger Games. But it sold a lot. You want to be part of that number? Go ahead and go buy it. It's out now. Moving on to question number uh, seven. There are. Uh, this is the last question of the day. This one makes me kind of sad again. I'm sorry. Um, there's 13 million people in danger of starving to death in the Horn of Africa. The Horn of Africa includes 
uh, Ethiopia, Kenya, and Somalia. Do you think, okay, here's your question. Do you think we should send, you know, uh, we should send more Red, we should send Red Cross over there, some supplies, you know, more volunteers focused in Africa? Or do you think we should uh, actually focus all that stuff in the st storms that have, the, the tornadoes and stuff like that? Uh, probably the people that are homeless in Texas or anywhere else in the entire world, you know, including other places. What's your opinion? What's your what's your answer? You can comment me or you can tweet me. Well, that's all the questions that we have today. Thank you for watching. You're the one. You're the millionth person to watch this, or probably the only person to watch this. And I thank you. I'm George X. Peace.